How y'all doing? My name is Kareem Green again with another sketch comedy show. I'm standing here with Tashia. Tashia, how you doing? I'm good. That's great. I want to ask you a relationship question. Check this out. When you're, when you're in a relationship, it's about trust and honesty, right? Of course. Okay. But what should you always, always lie about? How many sex partners you have? You always got to act like you hate your baby mama. <laughs> You yeah. always got to act like you hate your baby mama. Mm, how much money you had? And how many dicks you had? And where you was at last night? It depends on what day it is. She basically said everything. We not lie, but definitely omit. Never go into the number game. How many guys have you been with? First of all, I'm insulted at the question. You. That's all women care about is don't ask me how many guys I had. Well, so, so, you know, you know what, sometimes put your vagina away, okay? You can't just keep giving out the vagina and hate the numbers you're putting up on the vagina. Uh, well, you, you got somebody right now? Yes. All right, so we're going to make sure he see this and make you give him the right numbers. Right? Well, you know what? Don't ask me is what I'm saying. Okay, <laughs> but he's going to ask after this. <laughs> no, 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 just keep, keep lying. Just, just throw one more number on there. I, I said four was really four and a half. <laughs> exactly. He was short. Hi, it's Dell. I'm here with Sharon and Candace for another sketch comedy show. Ladies, how are y'all today? I'm oh, doing good. good. Okay, let's just jump right into it. All Have right. you been cheated on before? Uh, uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. I don't think so. You, you don't. You only been with one guy? No. <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Well, you've been cheated on before. Um, Candace, uh, Sharon, what happened, girl? <laughs> Candace, you gotta get off her highfalutin horse. I'm a little older, so. <laughs> yeah. What was the worst lie he told you? The worst lie that I ever told somebody cheating on me is um. He's thinking of a lie right now. I, I don't. I, I couldn't. I couldn't even tell. I don't lie in every type of way imaginable. Because you know, you, a woman knows when something is not right. You don't have to have proof, but you know. And then that's when you get to searching. Okay. Have you ever cheated on somebody? No. No. <laughs> no. The worst thing I ever did was tell the truth. I came home and I told her like, yeah, I was doing this, that, and the third with this girl. But I was being so playful with it that she thought I was playing. But I was serious. Okay. You know what? Cheating to me, it's, you know, there's, there's gray areas. So, <laughs> no, areas no. Cover and say no. <laughs> I have not cheated because I could just leave. What are those gray areas? Um, okay, maybe flirting is not cheating, but depending on how far you take it. Far? What's far? Kiss? Oh my Squeeze. God! Hi. Are you kidding me? Kiss is over! Oh, kiss is over! So those gray areas where you didn't know you were cheating, uh, was a kiss involved? <laughs> Yes. In my mind. I'm a cheated on. I had this little raggedy bra in Alabama, G. You know what I'm saying? Telling me I was the number one. I was getting money and everything too, but I didn't know how a rep was going. That was like Snoop, you know what I'm saying? They ain't tell the homie didn't let me know how she was getting down though, but she was running some little, you know, you know, old, you know, bobo on me, but it's all good though. You know, look at me now though. <laughs> on another sketch comedy show. What up? Yeah. What was the worst lie he told you? Oh man, that I'll be right back. And, and <laughs> I waited and I waited. I waited. I mean, it was been three days. I said, you know, I guess. She's still waiting, y'all. She's still waiting. <laughs> oh, the worst lie ever. I have told a lot, and that's why my wife doesn't trust me. Whenever I tell the truth, now she thinks I'm lying. Doesn't oh, trust you? Oh, What's the last lie you told your wife? I just lied to her. I just told her that I was at work, and I'm not. A oh, I, <laughs> I was on the receiving end of that one. Okay, okay. You get the voicemail at the work desk. So. And how did you catch him? Uh, actually, I had someone trail his car. What? Oh, yes. oh, I thought she was so innocent, okay? <laughs> she will follow you around. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. When it's time invested and you're in my house, oh, yes, we got the... The worst lie I have ever used, I said that uh, I had to take my grandmother to the hospital. Is your grandma still alive? No, she actually been dead for a while. <laughs> 
This is what's going on in the community, people. <laughs> that's you know that's what. One thing I learned about lying too. Uh, my, my my auntie told me if you start with a lie, you stick with that lie to the end. Is that what you do? Of course, you have to. You can't let them catch you in that lie. <laughs> I mean, so then when when can you let the lie go? You ain't supposed to. You supposed to take that with you to your grave. Oh, that's why women are always in church. <laughs> <laughs> Repent, <Aaron. laughs> They be like, you know what? Let me go to church. I got so many pent up lies. <laughs> Yo, that is so great. Let me know, let these people know what they're watching. Another, Another sketch, sketch comedy, comedy show. show. Yeah, yeah, yo, yo. <laughs>